Now that you have received your DBS system, it's important that you inform all of your other healthcare providers. Always carry your device's manufacturer's card with you so they can make a copy for their medical records. If they plan to do any procedures, they will need to contact the manufacturer of the DBS system to inquire how to perform them safely. For example, your dentist should be aware of your DBS device so they don't use any ultrasonic scaling tools or rest their electronic tools on your chest. If you're having a colonoscopy or other procedure, you will need to turn off your device or place it into surgery mode. It is up to you to know how to operate your system. We are here to educate you. The provider doing the procedure should call the manufacturer to make sure their equipment and procedure is safe. You can have an MRI under certain conditions. You will need to contact the DBS neurology nurse to discuss how to proceed with the MRI. If you go to the hospital, be sure to make a copy of your card. Any questions, call the number on the back of your DBS card. You should also avoid any activities that could damage the system and or brain tissue. Contact sports, arc welding, diathermy, electroshock shock therapy, transcranial magnetic stimulation, deep tissue massages around the system, and chiropractic adjustments of the neck are some examples. And always know where your patient programmer is and keep it and the recharging equipment with you in your carry-on luggage when you travel. At the airport, let security know you have a pacemaker so they can wand you through security. If you must go to the emergency room or hospital for any reason, be sure to have your patient programmer and recharging equipment with you in case you need to turn your stimulator off or on. It's also a good idea to teach a family member or care partner how to use it. You might need to turn off your DBS for your care team to get a good tracing on an EKG. You will also need your patient programmer with you in order to have an MRI. Do not expect that anyone other than you or your family will know how to operate it. Many people who undergo surgery choose to join research studies to advance DBS therapies. We will cover those opportunities in our next video.